Okay, now in this session we are going to discuss how to create difference, first difference and second difference after we import the data and create variable, then create lag variable. Now we are going to create differences, first and second difference. How? We'll go to the APUs and then we bring import data, that file or the data. Let me take this one which is already open inserted now we have this variable in the work file gdp gds and lag one gdp lag two gdp now in this session we are going to create first difference and second difference for the same variable let me say for gdp how i right click new object just type d gdp which is different GDP type of object is here is the same just click OK then you, when you click here you find it empty either you can insert data by editing open the gate or the door to insert the data or go to the comment which is easier D GDP equal D bracket GDP close the bracket and press enter look to the variable here you can see the variable inserted already lag one then here we can rename it d1 gdp press ok so this is difference gdp difference one gdp the second difference right click new object d d gdp which is second GDP the object is serious now everything OK press OK you can see here DD empty and then we have to insert the data we'll go to the command type DD GDP equal D bracket D bracket GDP double bracket and enter then we look here we find the data already inserted now to change to rename the variable as before rename it say d2 gdp which is difference to gdp and now we are we have the variable gdp gds lag one gdp lag two gdp lag when we say lag one lag two the model is going to be auto regressive model or dynamic model because the dependent variable become independent variable as a lag now now we have this variable here if we open it as a group we can see all the variable we created here GDP GDS lag 1 GDP lag 2 GDP difference 1 GDP difference 2 GDP and if here if you want to run a regression you can go to quick estimate equation and type all the variable gdp constant gds g lag one gdp lag two lag two gdp difference one gdp difference two gdp and so on this is all the variable we have it we created and now we run ordinary least square as you can see it here for the period 1980 to 2013 and then click okay l1 gdp l2 gdp d gdp d2 gdp okay because the data is let me just delete this part and then we run the regression we can see that this is the difference one difference two and then you can do the diagnostic test or any other uh, stability of the model as far as we have the data but now let me try again we'll see how why this one is not created signal because here we have let me say we'll take lag one 
lag on GDP, difference GDP, and so on. Now here we can see lag one, lag difference one for GDP, GTS. Thank you for watching the video.